Turning our attention now to the ASX, here's Matt Burney and Bulls and Bears with the latest public company views and interviews. Welcome to Bulls and Bears, brought to you today by medical device company OptiScan Imaging, ASX code OIL. I'm Matt Burney and I'm joined now by the Managing Director of OptiScan, Camille Farrar. Hi Camille. Hi Matt, how are you? Good thanks. Okay, so OptiScan Imaging has developed two microscopic medical imaging devices that could revolutionise and dramatically reduce the need for invasive biopsies amongst other other things. Its technology offers 3D imaging at a subcellular level in a non-destructive manner that enables clinicians to make immediate informed decisions and diagnoses in real time. This week OptiScan formed a partnership with Canadian software engineering firm ProLucid Technologies that will see the development of artificial intelligence for use with OptiScan's medical devices. Okay Camille, without getting all scientific on me in layman's terms, what exactly does your InVivage medical device do and how is it different to what's out there now? Yeah, thanks, Matt. So our technology basically is a slide-free, non-destructive, microscopic digital imaging technology. So it's basically a miniaturized microscope the size of a pen. Uh, You just touch that pen-sized microscope onto the tissue and you can see microscopic imaging of that tissue immediately on a screen. That allows a clinician or a surgeon to make an assessment about the presence of cancer or not. Also allows the surgeon to determine if they've resected a whole cancer clearly with clear margin. Now your second principal medical device is known as View and Vivo. How does that differ to InVivage? So View and Vivo is our base technology platform and that's typically used by research organisations and scientists including uh, Big Pharma for their research purposes. And it does pretty much the same thing, does it? It does pretty much the same thing. Uh, obviously the clinical device has more advanced uh, hardware and software in it. Tell me about this collaboration with ProLucid out of Canada. Which of your medical devices does this partnership relate? and how exactly are you planning to work artificial intelligence into it? So the relationship and the agreement uh, that we've signed with ProLucid relates to InVivage in the first instance and uh, we'll be tackling the issue of oral cancer and pre-cancer detection using artificial intelligence. And the whole notion is that the artificial intelligence will be able to provide clinicians and surgeons with an instantaneous answer as to the presence or absence of cancer or their clear margins. And then from there, they can make determinations regarding their next treatment. How will you monetize it? It will be basically a licensing provided to the hospital, the surgeon or the pathology lab depending on the purchaser of the base technology. Camille Farah from OptiScan Imaging, thanks for joining me on Bulls and Bears and remember, we're only here to give you information, not advice, which you should of course seek independently. I'm Matt Burney and this is Bulls and Bears. For more public company interviews, go to the money page on the 6PR, 2GB, 3AW and 4BC websites and click the public companies tab.